Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. While India is struggling to design and develop indigenous conventional or diesel attack submarine, it is doing exceedingly well in developing nuclear-powered ballistic missile submarine or SSBNs, aircraft carriers, destroyers, frigates, corvettes, patrol vessels and other auxiliary warships. Indian Navy has set a timeline of 2047 to become completely self-reliant. Navy has obtained acceptance of necessity for 75 projects. Out of these, 89% by value are for indigenous development. As per Indian Navy's long-term perspective plan, which is called Maritime Capability Perspective Plan, 45 ships are at present under various stages of construction. It is a 15-year plan that is reviewed every 5 years. The latest plan prepared is for 2022 to 2037 period. 43 out of 45 ships under this plan are being built in Indian shipyards and only two Talwar class frigate is being constructed in Russian shipyard. In today's video, we are going to talk about some of the important warships under Indian Navy's Maritime Capability Perspective Plan for the year 2022 to 2037. To begin with, we'll talk about Project 15 Bravo, the Indian Navy's most powerful destroyer. It is a class of guided missile destroyer having displacement of 7,400 ton under construction by Mazgaon Dock shipbuilders. The lead vessel of this class, INS Vishakhapatnam, was commissioned last year on 21st November 2021. Mormugao and Imphal are already launched in 2016 and 2019 respectively. Mormugao is set to be commissioned on 18th December 2022, while Imphal will be commissioned in 2024. The last vessel of this class is Surat, which will be commissioned in 2025. The overall cost of the project is Rs 35,800 crore or $4.7 billion. Next is the Project 17A or Nilgiri class frigates. The Project 17 Alpha are a series of guided missile frigates having displacement of 6,670 ton under construction by Mazgaon Dock shipbuilders and Garden Reach shipbuilders and engineers. Four out of seven vessels are being built at MDL and three at GRSE in Kolkata at an overall cost of Rs 45,000 crore or $5.9 billion. Five out of seven frigates which are Nilgiri, Udaygiri, Taragiri, Himgiri and Dunagiri are already launched and remaining two are under construction. The commissioning of the frigates will commence from 2023 onwards. Nilgiri and Himgiri are going to be the first two to be commissioned next year. Next we are going to talk about the Talwar class frigates. The Talwar class frigates or project 11356 are the class of stealth guided missile frigates designed and built by Russia for Indian Navy. The Talwar class guided missile frigates are improved version of Krivak 3 class or project 1135 frigates used by Russian Coast Guard. Indian Navy at present operates six Talwar class frigates since June 2003. Four more class of frigate were under construction in which two is being built at Yantra shipyard in Russia and another two at Goa shipyard limited under complete transfer of technology. The frigates under construction in Russia are already launched and they will start commissioning into Indian Navy from next year onwards. The frigates under construction at GSL is expected to be commissioned in the year 2026. Indian Navy will also get two submarines of Scorpion class or Culvery class being built by Mazgaon Dock shipyards. Four out of six submarines are already commissioned into Navy with latest one INS Vela commissioned on 25th November 2021. The remaining two, Vagir and Vakshir, have been launched. Vagir is reported to be handed over to Navy this month and commissioned next month, that is January 2023. 
the last submarine of this class Bakshir is planned to be commissioned by the year 2024. Now beside these warship navy is also building anti-submarine shallow water crafts to detect submarine and mines. GRC and CSL are building 16 of these vessels and first vessel of this class is going to be launched on 16th December 2022. GRC in collaboration with LNT is also building four survey vessels for Indian Navy. Three out of four vessels of this class have already been launched and the recent one was launched on 26th November 2022. Hindustan Shipyards Limited Vishakhapatnam is also building two diving support vessels Nistar and Nipun. The diving support vessel are 118.4 meters long, 22.8 meters at the broadest point and will have a displacement of 9350 tons. These ships have been launched on 22nd September 2022. The Indian Navy has also signed contract with Titagar Wagons Limited Kolkata for construction of five diving support craft on 12 February 2021 key laying for third vessel of this class was held on 12 August 2022 these ships would be deployed for deep sea diving operations additionally with deep submergence rescue vessel the dsps are designed to undertake submarine rescue operation in case requirement exists This was today's update please let us know your views on this in comment section if you like the video do not forget to like share and subscribe with this i would like to say goodbye and jai hind we'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector